Marriage equality can't wait. Um, we can't wait on this issue. Freedom can't wait. Mm, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> My friends in D.C. are going to like that. Uh, Judge Gray, speaking of can't wait, uh, you said this weekend that you can't wait to get on stage and debate uh, Vice President Biden. How would you respond to the Vice President's answer on marriage equality, or rather, the freedom to marry? I crave the opportunity to discuss issues with Mr. Biden and whomever Romney selects. And I can tell you that I really don't play politics, and I don't wait. I won't have any trouble at all discussing what Governor Johnson's views are on things. You just heard him. This isn't Obama, Obama, who knows? Who knows about Romney? But we do know about Governor Johnson. I'm proud to be his running mate. Thank you. And Steve? What will you as a member of Congress do for marriage equality? Well, we need, for starters, we need to repeal the Defense of Marriage Act, and we need to do it now. Bravo! And I will fight as a congressman to make that repeal happen. Let me just add, society wants commitment. And what's the matter with two people, be it gay, lesbian, or otherwise, committing to each other as adults? They're going to live together anyway. Let's get that commitment. Society favors it. It's a matter of, of equality, and that's what we stand for. Mm -hmm. And Steve, how do the libertarians set themselves apart from the Democrats and Republicans on this? Well, we are really, we're willing to come out and say right off the top that we support LGBT rights, and we support equality for everyone to marry who they want to marry.